happy birthday as well. You always find the latest courtyard. And in solution, Kate. In out of the box. Hello and welcome to Radio Waves by Dodderbert. If you enjoy reviews, comparisons, band scans of new and classic portable radios, then make sure to subscribe and tap the bell icon so you don't miss any of my most excellent videos. In front of us are the Sony ICF860. This is an AM FM TV band portable radio. This came from the 1990s. This particular one's made in 1991. Um, you can find these on eBay right now for $20 all day long. Tons of listings. I have a little links below. A great value for 20 bucks. Absolutely. This particular radio, though, was donated by an anonymous supporter of the channel. Thank you very much, sir. You know who you are. <laughs> so let's check it out. The ICF 860. Pretty neat. I didn't even know it existed, so <laughs> it's all new to me. Um, let's go over dimensions real quick. It's 10 and a quarter inches in length. We have a height of 5 inches and a case depth of 2 and a quarter inches. Do a little quick size comparison. Give you an idea here. We have the usual suspects. A CC pocket in the house. I'm doing this a little later in the night. It's 1.30, 6 a.m. in the morning, Central Daylight Time. I'm near Chicago, Illinois, USA. And next I have the CC Skywave. I like to keep this handy. Uh, if we do any frequency checking, uh, in case I get lost in the analog dial, it does happen. This radio isn't super selective, but it does a decent job. But sometimes they do get lost. <laughs> so this will be handy if we need it. And last but not least, we have a deck of cards. Iron Man, he's the man with the master plans. He loves Sony's just like I do, man. <laughs> Yeah, whatever, right? So there's that. Let's look at features of the ICF-860. Uh, it's cool overall. Let's uh, start with the left-hand side. We have an earphone jack. AC input, very nice. It did come with the AC cord. Um, nice to have that. You could run this all day long. It's a fantastic radio for a kitchen, um, desk, wherever you're working. Um, it's perfect for that using the AC. Loving it. Uh, front here, we have a three and a half inch speaker behind a metal speaker grill. Nice. Got the old sticker here. It's a Sony. Loving that. Sony again. A uh, really cool dial window. It's rather large uh, to accommodate the three different bands here. You get, or actually, four bands. You got your TV high, TV low, analog stations that no longer exist on the spectrum. Down here, we have the FM 88 to 108, and then AM is 530 to 1610 before they had the expanded AM band. Now this radio goes to 1650 in the evenings, and of course during the day I can pick up 1640. So it's, it's re relatively nice that it goes up that far on the band. So there you go, four band receiver, ICF 860, there's your bands. Band select switch, this one's pretty cool. It's this little tiny purple switch. <laughs> I've had this radio apart. Just to let you know, this radio is super easy to service, and this little tiny switch is actually hooked up and actuating a bigger switch on the back side of the board here. This is the radio module. And uh, it's really neat how they separate it. You have the AC module over here for the AC input, the speaker separate, and the radio module, which comes apart. Again, very easy to service. And this is neat how this uh, switch actuates this larger switch in the back. It's very cool. So we're gonna leave it on FM because we're gonna do a little uh, demo demonstration with audio, which is awesome. So we'll do a little close-up on the dial so you can see that. I like the white lettering and the blue dial indicator is okay, but the black uh, helps you distinguish the white number. So I like that. Right inside the radio, we have volume control, tone control, very nice, full control, high to low. Um, really like that. Tuning knob, it looks like it's hard to use, right? Well, if you look on the back side, it's got a nice open area here to run your thumb behind. So that's really cool, liking that setup. Smooth operator. <laughs> nice. Um, top of the radio, we have our power switch. The antenna, which is really awesome, 24 inch. And the reason why I like this antenna, it pivots 360 in all directions, pretty much. All You know, it can lay it down perfectly uh, horizontal when this radio is standing like this. It's beautiful. Um, in my area, I have to do that to get good FM reception. So yeah, 360 all the way around. We'll do an FM band scan. I'll show that in action. But then it stows away. It's got a little lock right there. Handy dandy, right? 
Okay, the back of the radio, I really like what's here. <laughs> it's got a flip out handle with a little recessed crab spot. There you go, you got your handle. Very, very nice to have when you're running around with it. <laughs> There's your tag, Sony ICF-860. There's the bands, AC input, and DC it runs on four AA batteries. And it's made in Malaysia. So I'll probably have some Malaysians go, all right, we rock radios. Because um, every time I mention Malaysia, Hong Kong, uh, there's some excitement there. So, okay, let's go ahead and put this down. Uh, you can see it's a vented area there, PB, uh, PCB and the speaker. Uh, that speaker magnet's rather large, for that three and a half inch speaker, not bad. Uh, it's got four screw holes to open it up. Uh, so if you're going to service this radio, which is really simple, uh, you take that screw out. There's one here, here, and then one behind the batteries uh, in the battery compartment. Let's go ahead and open that up, show you that real quick. Four AA batteries. Uh, so you have the top two positive to the left and the bottom two positive to the right when you're looking at the radio from the back side. Put this back on. All right, flip this handle down. So yeah, you take those four screws out. Big thing to remember, once you have the four screws out, um, take the uh, three knobs off. These do come off. Just pull them straight off. Um, they might be rather hard. Just wiggle them a little bit and they will come off. And make sure the power button's depressed down. Then what you're going to do is you're going to pull this cap off and that's going to allow you to remove the front panel, which is easy. So remember, swoop power switch on and remove this end cap once these three knobs are removed. It's fantastic. I had to use some Deoxic uh, D100 on these volume and tone control pots to help clean them up. They were scratchy. And then I used the Axic D5 for the switches. Uh, you don't want to use the D5 on the potentiometers, only on the switches. And it uh, worked real, real good. I'm real happy with it. So there it is. All right. Um, before we go further, I'd like to uh, also mention, yeah, when I had the radio apart, the internal AM antenna, a lot of people ask, the ferrite bar is uh, three and a quarter inches and it's nicely wound. It's a single coil design. So there you go. Um, FM reception report. Yeah, people like to know how good this is on FM. I always test these radios. We will do an FM band scan, but it doesn't really represent a good testing spot downstairs here. But we'll do it anyway, just so you get a feel for what the sound's like. Um, it did really, really well. Um, so most analog radios typically get uh, about 48 stations, uh, which is an okay to good rating. I have a five-tier method. Fair, okay, good, very good, excellent. And most analog, I guess, say radios fall between the okay to good, which is average. Uh, this radio is a little bit above average. This has got good sensitivity. Got, you got 55 stations found, which I thought was fantastic. Uh, when it comes to selectivity, though, I have to give it an okay to good rating, right middle of the road, because the selectivity is not fantastic. It's kind of a strong AFC circuit. So when you get close to a strong station, it locks on it right away. Uh, so you kind of miss those little faint stations. So I was surprised that I got those fainter stations, but when the big station was nearby, forget it. I wasn't going to get it. <laughs> so it's it's not bad overall, though. I'd, I'd give it a little above average rating. Two and three quarter star. Nice. So let's go ahead and turn this on. Rock out. <laughs> it's jamming. What I'm using for this audio demonstration is a C-Crane and a charging cord here. I happen to follow it. <laughs> this is a C-Crane FM transmitter 2 at 92.9 megahertz. And this is hooked up to a, a MP3 player broadcasting royalty-free music on that frequency. So any radio in my house, I can listen to this. This radio is picking it up, of course, tuned to 92.9 on the FM band. If I go here, we're on the AM. Go here, back to FM. So you see how that works. All right. So we'll run this for a few minutes to give an idea for the audio. Rock out. All right. Tone. Full low. Full high. And right in the middle. Somewhere right about here is what I like.
six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother. Quiet. A little scratchy there still. I not too bad. Okay. Yeah, it took a lot of work out of these pods, but uh, yeah, the DX D one hundred is perfect. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and just turn off that. Do some band scans. Turn off the charger. Okay, so we're gonna go to the bottom of the FM band, and we're doing FM band scan. Yeah. Pretty impressed with it. The cool thing is I can raise this antenna and we can move it back and forth. I may have to move this light, move this light out of the way here as I move this antenna around. Alright, so let's go ahead and see if we can pick up anything downstairs. Normally I just move this antenna around. Let's go this way here just to see if I pick up anything. I mean, in nine weeks' time, it means that while the Italians want to be going to the beach in, in August and September, they'll probably be uh, called to, to cram into sweaty political rallies instead. Um, the, the opinion polls, as you say, suggest that the right wing are going to win. That would be an earthquake here in Italy, but it would also shake the European Union to its core because Italy, of course, a founding member of the European Union. The EU still Maverick City Music, we keep it going. The encouragement, Tornwells leads you. Uh, Shed sends shivers down the spines of many in Brussels. She has, he has roots in neo fascism. <laughs> The, the third uh, broadcast of the same. Must be simulcast. <laughs> All these different stations. Silvio Berlusconi, remember him? Uh, mm. Ex-Prime Minister, still in his 80s. Both of them. <laughs>
We're finding pretty good amount of stations, liking it. Um, again, analog, the way it locks on, you can hear how it locks on those stronger stations. And I'm in a rural suburban area, so I'm picking up, you know, uh, the city of Chicago and some outlying areas. And notice the FM dials, fairly accurate. of storage the low footboard option and it's distinctive concave this is uh 105.9 um wbbm on fm so pretty cool old-time radio monday to friday 12 a.m to 1 a.m central daylight time very cool the avery bedroom collection with queen bed you can listen to fm there's storming storms outside not to worry about crackling static typically with fm locations throughout chicagoland pennymustard.com better version Okay, I think it's top of the band. Yep. All right, cool. So that's the FM, not bad, I enjoy it. Uh, again, this radio's cool. When I saw it was only 20 bucks all day long, like buy it now, free shipping, uh, yeah. This thing is worth picking up for 20 bucks, <laughs> definitely, for a used radio. Uh, I got it for a donation, which is fantastic, but uh, I'm gonna retract the antenna since we have the three and a quarter inch fair right inside for the AM band. So let's go ahead and Go to the bottom and we'll do an AM band scan and I'll give you final thoughts on this radio. So let's go ahead. You already kind of have an idea what my opinion is going to be. So all the way over on AM. Let's go ahead and turn it up. Not sure if we have storms in the area. We might. Okay. He's cheating on you with another radio show. Right now. I'm yelling out my name. <laughs> Stephanie Miller, now. 540 WAUK, Jackson, Wisconsin. Now, during the day, expect a great uh, sounding reception on locals, of course, uh, and semi-locals, which are halfway decent. Uh, distance stations are possible with a loop. Um, they are there, just a little harder because the noise floor on this radio is a bit higher with the distance stations, which you'll hear when I'm going through here. Now, sometimes the tone control can help eliminate some of the hiss. X is kind of a filter. Local musical interlude is brought to you by Max Inc. Radio. The wrong basement. I get it. That's the base of waterproof inner foundation repair experts in woods basement system. KTRS 550, St. Louis, Missouri, 275 miles, 5,000 watts, the south, southwest, that's where that's pointed. Top of this radio, you'll notice me moving the radio, that's uh, the aim towards the station, and uh, that internal antenna picks up the, and tunes it. There you go. St. Louis. So yeah, you got the call letter school. Oh, but yeah, you point this top edge of the radio towards the station trying to receive to improve reception. 
The second primetime hearing by the January... YND Chicago, streaming at 560theanswer.com on the AM560 mobile app. Tune in, iHeart, and on Odyssey. Police officer murdered on Jack Kella and Fox News in Rochester, New York. Two police officers... So here's 560 WIND Chicago. Street Thursday evening, rushed to the hospital. One of them died of his injuries. Pick up any faint stations. There might be some storm activity. Congressman Lee Zeldin as he campaigned for New York's Republican gubernatorial nomination. The attacker had brass knuckles with blades attached. Supporters quickly. Air 620 WTMJ in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. The number of other people then jumped up on the. The president's inaction during the insurrection was too much for her to take. His refusal to condemn the violence was indefensible. Eight o'clock. And so I knew that I would be resigning that evening. The committee played outtakes from a recorded. Yeah, I think it's a 650 national versus check. But this election is now over. Congress has certified the results. I don't want to say the elections are over. I just want to say. Congress has certified the results without saying the election's over, okay? The committee also played audio from an interview with a security professional who so, yeah. worked in the So, yeah, 650 national Tennessee is 434 miles to the south. Harry Borg, Joy Bird, stay home. In score radio history. If you missed it, here it is right now on Score Overnights. Boars and Bernstein. Afternoons on the score. Here's 670 the score, WCR Chicago, home of the Cubs. Hilarious. The angry, armed mob of President Trump sent to the Capitol broke through security in the Cube Capitol. Last year, Dick's more the vote counting to stop. Sarah Matthews, the White House staffer. Here's 700 WLW Cincinnati, Ohio, 300 miles to the east. There's a camera that is on in there at all times. And so if the president had wanted to make a statement um, and address the American people, he could have been on camera. The town is cutting her third term short and will resign August 12th. She said it's because of family issues. Mayor Lightfoot will appoint a replacement. Other North Side Alderman 720 WGN Austin Chicago. Kappelman also aren't seeking re-election, but will serve out the remainder of their term. WGN Sports. Tyler Accuracy is fairly good on the AM band as well. Open up the second half of their season Friday night. The Southsiders host the Guardians for the first of four games. Everything I want the world to be is now coming true. Got some music on CFZM, Toronto, Ontario, uh, 740. It's pretty cool. I always get this. Comes in nice. Um, 460 miles to the northeast. In this life, you have an awesome responsibility to those children who love you the most and want to be you in every way. So make a pledge today to be a good role model to these kids and their friends so that that little boy and that little girl get to grow up and be just... 750 WSB Atlanta, Georgia, 630 miles. This is just more of a demonstration. I'm probably not going to get through the whole band, but we'll zip it up to the top here in a little bit. Your local radio stations are here for you. No subscriptions or monthly fees necessary. There We're here to give you the news, weather, and traffic you need, and the music you love. But if the foreign-owned record labels get their way, it could stop the music. They want Congress Whoa. to force radio stations to pay them more money, simply Whoa. to play their music. Don't let radio go silent. Text LOCAL to 52886 and tell Congress to protect local radio stations. This message furnished by the National Association of Broadcasters. At Mr. Sparky, we're America's on-time electrician. Mr. Sparky. As a homeowner, safety is key in finding someone you trust to work on your home's electrical. Don't take chances. Unvaccinated young adult. Paralysis. It's no longer contagious, but investigators are working to try to figure out if others were exposed to the virus. Christopher Cruz, CBS News. 
Chicago's news traffic and weather station. 780. News Radio 105.9 and WVBMNewsRadio.com. It's Sounds Friday, good. July 20th. Yeah, I, I like uh, listening to the AM uh, 780 uh, instead of the FM. Uh, it comes in clear and that's, you know, radio shows are in mono anyway, so it's perfect. Early morning low in the upper 60s, later today, interval five. Let's go a little quicker. Daniel Johnson, clear skies as we head through the rest of tonight with comfortable Sounds temperatures like in the mid-70s. Lots of sunshine sticking around for Friday, but the stickiness, the increase in dew point, the humidity, it starts to go up. Temperatures will be in the upper 90s on Friday, feeling more like 100 because of some of that higher humidity. By Saturday, Here's 840 WHAS, Louisville, Kentucky. Right now they're having coast-to-coast -coast AM. It's nice and late at night, <laughs> 12 a.m. to 4 a.m. Daniel Johnson. Coast to Coast AM is on. There News is. Radio 840 W. Call letters I just tuned away from. Elle trébuche au matin dans un poème. Music there, CJBC 860, Toronto, Ontario again. Cool. Okay, we're going to zip up to the top of the band and give you final thoughts. Nice. There you go, WCBS, New York, New York, 750 miles. Is not buried in a former landfill under the Pulaski. You're, uh, you're uh, joining us this morning. Is <laughs> you do Halloween swag. I'm gonna zip off the dial. <laughs> Burns spoke with the county executive. Polio cases. He's no longer with us. Not that he's so really, really busy show, and I thought he's on another planet. He has a personal newsletter which comes out about once a week, sometimes. Thus, not that he's on. The so today we're excited to tell you about. In the case of Charles Barton. Coast to coast everywhere, of course. <laughs> Fifteen thirty WCKY Cincinnati Ohio, cool, three hundred miles. Does not attack. The oil bulls will open, and the ultimate result will be like it. Brother Stare on the AM band of the USA. Sixteen ten CHHA Toronto. Just picking up a hint at 1630, I think, here, KCJJ. Very neurotic. They want everyone to love them. And they don't want to be tied to any kind of controversy. And I guarantee you. Okay, so 1650 uh, KCNZ, Waterloo, Iowa. Cool. That, Charles that ends it. All right, turn off the radio. <laughs> I like that push button style power switch. Real nice. So, yeah, this is pretty worth 20 bucks all day long. Uh, check out the links below. Support the channel. Pick one up. Have yourself a fun time with this radio. Take it anywhere with you. Make sure you get the AC cord with it when you buy it used. Make sure it's not abused too much. But if it is, you can fix it. And that's the nice thing about it is you can get in there and you can clean those potentiometers. Um, Easily, like I said, just four screws, take the side plate off after you take those three knobs off, and boom, this comes apart, no problem. Two screws, takes the radio module out. Um, yeah, so it's just a fantastic radio. I love it. Um, and you can get to this power switch to clean it without having to remove the AC board, which is a nice thing.
So if you like the video, give me a big like. You guys are the best. Two, if you like Sony radios and want to see more, hit subscribe to the bell icon. Get notified of future reviews. And I do have another Sony coming along. Yeah. So that's always fun to watch. And three, comment below what you think about the Sony ICF860. Is it one you'd want for your collection or just around the house? Let me know. All right, guys. Take care. And we'll see you in my next video.